Hey guys, my name is Foulplace, and my goal is checking out every single devil fruit inside the game. We are almost done. We have a few more to go, so let's just get this started and as well hook you up with all the codes inside the game. So let's hop over back to Middletown. So, of course, if you've not seen my last episode, we tried out the love fruit this thing is actually crazy i'm still super 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 excited that this thing is so good and i'm excited of course to check out another fruit today so the bad thing of course is we've not had an update since the last christmas so i am excited of course to just create my own content which is testing out some more devil fruits i still hope that the next update is coming soon but you know we'll just cross our fingers for that so if we go to our trustworthy blocks fruit dealer and we click interact we can see that of course he has a lovely stock of fruit so you can see we have actually quite a few of these you can see with all these equips we have all the highest fruits we have the kitsune we have the leopard we have dragon spirit venom shadow doe you know all those kind of things but there's still a few we have not checked out just like portal and like phoenix etc so the ones i still have to check out are portal phoenix sound and spider before we get to love and of course you can see we already tried buddha there's a lot more fruits up above that that i want to check out but i think i'm gonna focus on these right now so you can see right now i have four of the fruits on the list and we're just gonna go spin i'm excited where we're gonna get we're gonna just click a few shuffles and see what we get so we're either getting sound phoenix portal or spider today so let's go ahead and press the spin wheel and see what we end up with so today's fruit we are testing is gonna be the spider fruit okay i think this fruit definitely is an underdog i don't think anyone would really grab it up if it was their first choice but maybe just like the love fruit is gonna pleasantly surprise us so back in the game, we're gonna go get and grab up the spider fruit. So this thing is, of course, currently out of stock. We need to pay it with one potato robux. We as well will go ahead and give away this fruit to you guys that face it. So if you guys want to get yourself the spider fruit and some extra fruits, of course, be sure to stay tuned and keep watching because we're gonna do a giveaway near the end of the video together with all the codes in the game. All right, so the spider fruit is equipped. You can see it at the bottom, and you can see we have the spider's wrath, the multi-string attack, the overheated sniper, the ultimate threat, and the spider's path. So What's interesting about this one? Actually, Spider Spet is only level 15. Okay, interesting. So, we're gonna go to our trustworthy place, and I like to just click home right here, teleporting to the whirlpool in three, uh, two, and one, and boop, there we go. And then we're gonna go inside of the whirlpool, and we're gonna check out these abilities okay the love fruit last time was amazing. Let's see what the spider fruit does. So, let's use the spider's wrath, uh. Yeah. All right, so this seems a very close range ability. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, oh it, it knocks everyone up, but it's kind of sucks that it's so short range. I love when the abilities are a little bit long range. And as well, the cooldown is so long. Holy. And it seems to be three spider rats to take an enemy down. That is quite a lot, guys. That's quite a lot. And slice. There we go. Got us a bunch of masters and a fish tail. Not too bad. We are already mastered level 44 just after that. And we've unlocked spider path. I think this is going to be a spy, like a silky slingshot. You know, let's see. Oh, wait. Huh? It is. It is a fly. Okay, I definitely expected some Spider-Man grapple action, but I didn't expect a flying, you know, ability at all. And it seems to follow the mouse. That is actually very nice. Okay, it's better than I thought it would be. Sadly that the Z does no damage. And there we go, level 50 has achieved. Okay, I'm still interested what's going to be the overrated sniper. Ultimate threat, of course, we will uh, not get to in 25. I'll, I'll spoil you guys that. Uh, I don't really like to grind something that, you know, probably is going to be trash or not that great. So, uh, yeah, we're just going to get level 100 today. But we still have the multi-string attack to check out. So let's see what we're getting. So multi-string attack, please, let's be a long range. Okay, I can hold it down. You can see I'm holding it down right now. And release. Okay. It seems like a pretty decent ability to combo, but it still doesn't seem crazy good. So we can do like Spider's Wrath into String Attack? Yeah, okay, not too bad. Not too bad. And there we go, level 100 mastery. Easy peasy has been obtained. So 
We now have the overheated sniper. As well, it seems that multi string into spider wrath is the best combo for now. But let's see what the overheated sniper will do. So let's see. Okay. This definitely is the third ability to use. That is half damage, though. Still not enough to finish them off in two abilities, but it is something. It would have been nice if it was two abilities and they were done. But let's just see. So I would use multi-string attack into Spider's Wrath into... Oh, I need more energy. Ah, that kind of sucks. But it's fine. It's good enough because Spider's Wrath actually flings them far away. But would I say this is a good fruit? Eh, it's okay. It does decent damage. I don't really like fruits too much that fling away the enemy too much because it's kind of annoying. But let's just throw it on the boss. Alright, let's start with the multi-string attack and push him into the ground. Use this. And then we have to wait for 70 energy and boom, there we go. It's pretty loud. It is pretty loud, but you know, not too bad. Comes back to us. Then we multi-string attack him again in the ground. Boom, there we go. Overheat that sniper has a very long cooldown though. Uh, so that kind of sucks. Then we overheat sniper him. There we go. And then we can multi-string attack him again. Boom, in the ground. Slash. And just keep on dodging. Alright, so it, it is a very safe fruit, though. It's a very safe fruit. Like, I hardly will take any chances of taking damage. Because of this CC ability. Like, the, the multi-string attack is actually the best ability he has. Because of the CC. It is not bad, though. It's not bad. What would I rate this fruit? I probably would rate it a 6.3 out of 10. It is not amazing. It doesn't have extra auto attack abilities, you know. The abilities itself don't do the most amount of damage. It's very safe. Good CC. But that's technically it. That's where it stays by. The overheated sniper is too much energy to use. Like, if you could use all three in great succession, it would be nice. But I have to wait long, long cooldown on the overheated sniper as well, so... Yeah, I think 6.3 is pretty perfect. Okay, guys, let's go take a look at the codes, though, that are working currently in Blocks Fruit. So, of course, some codes are expiring, some codes are being added. So, this is always a big work and a big list to keep on, you know, checking and seeing if everything is working. So, after this, as well, we're doing the giveaway for today. So, be sure to stay tuned for that. So, let's get started with the bottom of the list. We have 34 codes, guys. Sub to Gamer Robots or Underscore Reset 1. We got that as the first code. Then we have this code, the Grade Ace. Then we have code kid reset. We have sub to Captain Maui after that. Then we have source code kid gaming. We have source code sub to fur nine and nine. After that, we have source code nu is pro with some underscores. Then we have source code magic bus. We have source code jcwk after that. Then we have source code star code heo. Code bluxy. We have source code fud ten underscore v two. We got us code sub to gamer robot underscore xp1. We have us code sub to uncle Kizaru. Then we have us code axior. We have us code sub to dyke rock. Then we have code big news after that one. And then we have us code sub to noob master one, two, three. We have us code straw head main. Then we have us code tantai gaming. After that, we have source code sub to official newbie. We have source code FUD10. We have source code devs cooking. Then we have source code fruits concepts. I've never seen this one. Oh, it's invalid. This one's gone then. Okay. Uh, we have source code crazy dares is gone. Uh, we have code triple abuse is gone. This just happens, guys. Some of these codes just are disappearing after. So source code seat trolling is gone 24 no admin is there okay that works so this is code reward fun then we have this code new troll okay then we have this code secret underscore admin which is gone and then we have source code chandler and then two more guys we have source code admin there's there we go new one we've not used this one i don't know what it gave me actually uh, we'll check it out in a second. And then we just code admin hacked. There we go. We're gonna set refund. Okay, not bad. Gives you 20 minutes of two times experience. Okay, not bad. So at least for me personally, two new codes. But of course, be sure to use all the codes and check them out. Of course, we need to make sure that you guys have not missed a single code that currently works in the game before they are gone. And as well, like I said, I want to give away a spider fruit, but I do as well like to give away my favorite fruit. So my number one fruit still to this day is Kitsune. And this will be a Kitsune giveaway until I find something better. And as well, 
Oh, on top of that, we are dropping in uh, a Buddha fruit. And let's truck it. I'd like to do four every time. So we will do a shadow this time. So if you guys want to get yourselves a shadow fruit, a kitsune fruit, a spider fruit, or a Buddha fruit, which if you have to like to this video, subscribe if you're new, comment down below, hashtag fruit to get up with your Robux username, and that's everything you're going to have to do. So yeah. That is it going to be for me on Blocks Fruits for today. Let me know what you guys think about this spider fruit. Would you buy it? Do you think it's absolute garbanzo? And which fruit should I try next? Let me know in the comment section down below. Of course, we still have a bunch more to try. And maybe I'll find my favorite fruit in the next episode. So, say so, yeah, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy, hit the like button down below. Guys, subscribe to see you guys later today or tomorrow for another video. So, yeah, guys, take care. Love, bye. Thanks so much for watching. And, of course, as well, take care, guys.